Welcome to the HTML tutorial series. This is lesson number 31. And in this lesson, we're going to be taking a look at the require HTML attribute, which basically is going to force a user to have to enter in some information in a particular input field. So let's go ahead and get started. The first thing that you want to do is make sure that you have the HTML document open that we've been working on throughout this video series. If you have that open, let's go ahead and move forward. I'm going to go ahead and look for an input field that I want to make required. In this case, I'm going to make the username input field required. So let's go ahead and go to that. And right after the word input, I'm going to write the word required. And you'll notice that I have a space before the word required and after it. So make sure there's a space. You don't want the word required and typed together because it will make it have an error. Okay, so make sure there's a space gap between there like what you see on my screen. So once you have that, let's go ahead and hit Control S to save it and preview it in our web browser. So once you have it loaded in your web browser, we're going to go ahead and enter information in some of the other fields other than the username. And then let's go ahead and try to hit the send button. You'll notice that it says, please fill out this field. And the reason it says that is because we made it into a required field. Okay. So that is how you use the required HTML attribute. If you wanted to apply the same thing to other input fields, you would simply just write the word required after the word input, and it would make that field required. So I hope that this video was helpful in showing you how to use the require HTML attribute. If it was, make sure you leave a thumbs up. If it wasn't helpful, leave a comment in the comment section and I'll do my best to assist you. If you want to uh, request a tutorial, make sure you leave us a tweet on Twitter. And if you would like to encourage us to produce future tutorials on this channel, make sure that you subscribe and share this video.